Governor Abbott signed the so-called heartbeat bill into law on Wednesday. Millions of children lose their right to life every year because of abortion. In Texas, we work to save those lives. The Texas version of the abortion legislation is different to similar bills in other states as it bans women here from having an abortion if there's a heartbeat, which can happen as early as six weeks into the pregnancy. It also allows people to sue women or abortion providers who undergo the procedure past that six-week mark. A general rule in the law is that if the government cannot regulate it directly, it cannot empower other citizens to regulate it indirectly through lawsuits either. Legal expert Jeffrey Dixon with Texas A&M Central Texas says the law will almost certainly be challenged before September. It's just a matter of who is sued to stop the law from being enforced. There is a constitutional right to choose whether to have an abortion at least in the first trimester of pregnancy. Um, and to a lesser extent, depending on which decision you consult after that. According to the CDC's abortion surveillance, in 2018, the abortion ratio was 189 abortions per 1,000 live births for women ages 15 to 44. CareNet Pregnancy Center of Central Texas doesn't advocate for or against abortions, but says the new law could increase the number of women they see. We are a place where there's no judgment. We we want to give these women information. We want to give them information on things maybe they haven't thought about. We want to be there for them no matter what they choose. CareNet offers women multiple resources before, during, and after a pregnancy, such as testing, counseling, and shelter for the mom and the baby. While they don't help women get an abortion, they do provide support for those who do. We absolutely call them, check up on them. We'll go to the hospital if they have to go to the hospital to sit with them. Because most of the time, women who have abortions, they're ashamed even to go into the hospital. CareNet says most women that visit the center know they're pregnant before the six-week mark. They welcome any women who are in need of help as their services are free. Joel Lopez, 25 News.